just cause. Does your organization offer your people a cause so just that they would be willing to sacrifice themselves, their interests, in order to advance that cause? Now, one of my favorite examples of a just cause was written down in the United States in the Declaration of Independence. The Founding Fathers of America wrote down a reason why they wanted to go to war and create their own country. All men are created equal, they said, endowed with unalienable rights, amongst which include life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. In other words, they presented an ideal vision of a future state that did not yet exist, an ideal so inspiring that they were willing to commit their honor, their fortunes, and their lives in order to advance. And winning the Revolutionary War was simply a finite victory in this infinite game. Upon winning that finite victory, like winning a client, now the heavy work begins, like the founding of the company, now the heavy work begins. They will never actually achieve that ideal, but they will die trying, and that is the point. And we can see throughout the history of nations, when these nations are trying to advance their ideal state, whether it's the abolition of slavery, slavery, or women's suffrage, or gay rights, we can see that there's a striving towards that ideal state that they'll never actually reach. Organizations need to offer their people a cause so just that they would be willing to sacrifice, and it has nothing to do with the products you make or the services you sell. No one is inspired to sacrifice uh, going on frequent business trips and being away of, from their family so that you can make the best products at the best possible value. Nobody cares about that. Steve Jobs, for example, had an ideal vision of the future state, a just cause. He imagined a world in which an individual could stand up to Big Brother. They imagined a world in which an individual could compete with a corporation. It just so happened that the personal computer was the perfect product to help them advance their just cause. And the people who signed up to be a part of their company and were proud and loyal customers, it wasn't just that the, the product was better, that was debatable. It was that they saw themselves as champions for this cause. That cause became their own. It's not an accident they attracted young people and creative people to be such zealots for their products. It's because these were the people who liked the idea of standing up to Big Brother. That was a just cause. Sacrifice doesn't necessarily mean sacrificing your life. As I said before, going on frequent business trips, being away from your family, working late hours, knowing that you could probably make more money at another job. But I choose to stay here and I choose to do those things, not because I like those things, but because they feel worth it. Are you offering your people something to feel a part of, something bigger than themselves, a vision to advance that they feel is worth the sacrifice? You must have a just cause to play in the infinite game.